Welcome to the Chaser TV, how to send video to the web in just three minutes. Let's get started. First thing we're going to want to do is go to Google and search for Adobe Media Encoder 3. You'll come up with uh, the first hit on Adobe's website. Go ahead and download and install that program. Once you're logged into the Chaser TV website, go ahead and click on Feature Settings. That's going to bring you to this page here. We want to scroll down about halfway down the page here to where we see the Flash Media Encoder settings. Once we have Flash Media Encoder running, we're going to want to make sure that we can see video on the screen, as you can see here. If you can see the video on the screen, then everything's great. If not, you can select different cameras from this pull-down. Make sure this setting is set to VP6, 29.97. Change the bit rate to 35 kilobits per second. Make sure the audio is turned off. Make sure time code is turned off. Now we're going to need our FMS URL. That was what we had on the Chaser TV website. We'll just go ahead and copy and paste that off of here. You're going to want to be careful when you copy and paste this off here because sometimes what will happen is a space will get stuck on the end. That is the most common setup problem with Flash Media Encoder on our site. You can tell there's a space here on the end as I move the cursor back and forth. We're going to want to delete that off and make sure that only the underscore is on the end. Now we're going to go back to our website here, and we're going to copy off the stream name just exactly the same as we did before. We'll paste that in here. Once again, checking to make sure we have no extra space. We'll check the Auto Adjust box here. Switch it to Degrade Quality. We'll click on the Crescent Wrench. Make sure that is set to 10 kilobits per second and preserve video quality. Click OK. Click Connect. Click Start. Once you click Start, it will start publishing your video to the web. The next step is to come to the Chaser TV website and check your box to On Air. Once you've done that, you can come back to the home page. And as you can see, our test account is now streaming live on the Internet. That's how you can set up Chaser TV in just three minutes. Thank you, and have a good day.